A new champion is crowned. A former champion gets his rematch. Hey, I'm Attack Slug, uh, back here doing uh, the 2K Showcase mode in 2K15 for the PS4. We are here, we are apparently going to play as uh, a man who is no longer in the company, Mr. Ray Mysterio Jr., if you will. And, uh, this, this, so I'm playing as Mysterio, but he, doesn't he lose this match? Wasn't that the whole, like, he was, li he was champion for, like, a week? Or no? Never mind. I'm John Cena. I shouldn't be going to the top rope. That was a bad idea. I didn't know what character I was. Uh, I'm used to the game starting you in uh, the upper left corner and not the lower right corner. Like, uh, effectively, the game made me player two. What the hell's that? John Cena is not player two. John Cena is player one. Oh, come on now. Mysterio with this chain wrestling nonsense. Since when does John Cena chain wrestle? Like, really? Think about that. How often have you ever seen John Cena... Fucking what? I did the two and... and they... oh. Dear video game, you're bullshit. This is why I had Ebenezer as a super... Fuck your arm drag, Mysterio. As a super heavyweight to avoid this fucking hot garbage. See, that didn't even... I literally had no chance to, to do that because the CPU is the CPU. I, I can understand, you know, a li really? Didn't even do a move to him? I can understand a little bit, you know, if you wanted to do it player versus player, but when you can just immediately make the CPU do whatever they want to do, uh, that's hot garbage. And anyone who's ever designed a video game should know. Just fucking punch him. Uh, yeah, salute you, because you can't see me. Doing my little asshole hands. Yep. 98? Nope, too fast. So as you can see, uh, clearly, I am still not very good at this game. Uh, it's too late. The timing stuff on this stuff is just real. So if, if I end up losing this match, which, you know, could, could certainly happen, uh... I don't know if I should scrap the whole video and start over, or if I should just let it roll and do it again. So, uh, I suppose that remains to be seen until it actually happens. What the fuck was that? The fuck? Have one of these. Have, have a fucking takedown. Do a move, John Cena. I'm hitting the X button. Do a goddamn move. Where is your hustle, loyalty, and respect? Huh? Where is it? Yeah, because it was so believable for Mysterio to beat Big Show and Kevin Nash. That's plausible in, in any universe. The suspension of... Haha, you missed. I'm hitting the X button. Do something. Super Cena. Ah, oh, you're the worst. You're the worst, Mysterio. You're the worst. Being all squirrely and fucking pain in my ass. I need to damage you moderately. I must damage you moderately. Stop fighting back so much. Oh, come on now. Come on now. Did they, like, put his thing here on Legend or what? Just clothesline him. Cl what are you doing, John Cena? What is your problem? Yeah. There's the instant Super Cena. Here's your, uh... Here's your attitude adjustment, or, you know, your FU. There we go. Oh, God. Nope, I'm out. I'm out. I'm out. F that. Nope. Don't remind me of that travesty that was WrestleMania 9. It's hot garbage. What? He reversed that? Really? You've got to be kidding me. So I need to get my signature up 
and then have him on the ground like that and then do my five knuckle shuffle here we go just yeah get into position there mr mysterio and uh let me do this dumb hand drop on you and now we can attitude adjust you because that is what we do around here oh really I'm supposed to overcome the odds for your hard-earned dollars. Are you effing kidding me? I'm gonna get 619. Great. Great! And he's gonna, yeah, do that. Really? What a maneuver. Yeah, right! Oh. That was... I think I missed doing a comeback, too. I'm hitting triangle. Let me do a comeback. Ha 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 ha! I am John Cena! I will not sell for you, Ribbit Stereo. You are a tiny, tiny man. And of course, I get reversed. What the fuck? Rope break. I would have got rope break there. The computer doesn't get rope break there. Yes, the, the patented John Cena drop kick. Because that happens so often. Do your finisher. I'm on a fucking stamina. God. Great, I'm gonna get pinned here. This is gonna be the worst. What the hell are you doing, Rey Mysterio? Really? Five star frog splash. Hey, no, get up. Get up. There we go. Oh, it kicked me in the butt. Really? What's with that butt kick? I reversed that. That's. Fuck. Fuck you, Rey Mysterio. Stunner! Give him a stunner! Man. Perfect setup for a fucking. Stone Cold Stunner there, and you didn't do it. Now, do not reverse this attitude adjustment. Take your adjustment of your attitude. And do it again? Oh. This game. The things that they want me to do in this game. Screw it. Count, ref. I didn't get the third one. I had to do another attitude adjustment, and then pin him was the last objective. Fuck that. I got the pinfall. I'm not gonna go through a whole other thing of almost got my ass cut by Mysterio to lose to do another fucking attitude adjustment. I just did one. I don't think so. I refuse video game to be that accurate because you and your goddamn legend difficulty. This was the, this was the bullshit part where was was this was this this raw where they, where they hit the music and yeah here comes CM Punk and I'm the real champion like they kept him off TV for a week he did like a Comic Con he had a picture of the belt in his fridge and that was it like that was the that's a terrible John Cena face that was all they did but it's like oh no we got to get him back for SummerSlam that's you know super important because it's because it's SummerSlam. And it's like, really? You really didn't need to. You really didn't need that to happen. Um, you could have kept that angle so hot had you kept him off TV. Uh, and had you not done this nonsense tournament. Like, keep Punk off TV. Don't have a dumb tournament for uh, a replacement belt. Just be like, we have to track down our real belt. This is a serious, serious business, guys. Um, and that would have been great, but... Obviously, hindsight is twenty twenty, and they didn't do that. Uh, instead, they did what they did here. So, uh, kind of nonsense. But um, that match was faster than you know the last one because obviously, it's like I apparently sk I skipped a um, I skipped a step there uh, in that final attitude adjustment uh, thing. I I'm not sure. Like. I think doing all those is what unlocks you all the stuff, but I've already unlocked all the stuff. So, for me, getting through and seeing how they present the story and what story beats are they going to use uh, is the interesting part. Um, and telling me this stuff in a static cutscene, in like a static image, is really funny. Uh, so we're going to do one more today because uh, I think, you know, trying to shoot for an average of about 20 minutes would be a good uh, cutoff point. I don't want to go too long, but I don't want to be too short. So here we are at SummerSlam. 
aka Sucker Slam. And this was the match where Triple H was the guest referee. Yes, it was. Back when Triple H still had long hair. Before he just uh, cut that shit off. It was that. That was the end of an era. Uh, and specifically the era of Triple H video game hair. Uh, and obviously, you know, we had the old model of Triple H in here. But forever, it's been like, well, how far have video game graphics come? And it's like, well, go look at Triple H's hair and see how much better it looks this year. Because he was in the games for so long. He's the CEO, according to him. And, uh, yeah. So, I don't... Like, I don't know that, that necessarily that, you know, even when you're an authority figure, I don't know that you, you should get your full full entrance as, as you are coming out, you know, to work as a referee in this match. So, I don't think you should get your full entrance. I don't know. That's just me. I mean, it, it's better than having to deal with Shawn Michaels in those fucking tiny-ass shorts that he did when he was always a guest ref, which was... Uh, stop, Shawn Michaels. Stop. Not cool. So, I can say at least Triple H is wearing pants. Uh, so that is that is a positive in that column. Um, but that was back around a time when they pretty much let Sean do whatever the hell he wanted to do. So, he was like, no, I'm going to do a ref shirt and, like, hot pants. And it's like, what? So, this is a very extended... This is like the full Triple H intro, which is kind of ridiculous. Um, and I'm still... Like, the fact that... These games reuse so many assets and so many everything um, is interesting when it comes to this year's game because clearly they cannot reuse the voice work of uh, Mr. Justin Roberts, who is no longer with the company. So that means either Lillian Garcia or Tony Chimmel or Eden Styles or uh, Howard Finkel. Uh, is going to have to uh, record a whole lot of voice work um, for this year's game. And perhaps a combination of those four, I don't know. Personally, uh, I, would like to, I would like it to all be Howard Finkel, but I know that that's probably not going to happen, uh, which is a damn shame because this is Howard motherfucking Finkel is the best. But that's uh, I guess a lot of that for me is nostalgia, because that's what I grew up on. Uh, with Howard Finkel, so. But, here we are. This is our champion versus champion match. As CM Punk takes his sweet time getting to the ring with the belt that he uh, won and then walked out with. Uh, which was, as I said, a fantastic angle that they squandered pretty hard. Um, and then here comes uh, Super Cena. Which I'm going to skip his intro because he's Super Cena, and uh, you've Super seen it uh, about 80,000 times over the course of the past, I don't know, decade. Um, and I personally, as soon as it actually cuts to, yeah, alright, goodbye Super Cena, we're not watching your en entrance. It's, um, I'm sure there, there probably was some dialogue there or something, but at the same time, tired of Super Cena. So... Uh, here we go. The Undisputed. So this stuff, the fact that they've, you know, went out of their way to make this stuff as as accurate as they can, you know, with the budget they have, uh, is things that I enjoy. Uh, I feel like the, the belt could look better. Uh, that belt looks terrible, but... That is what it is. From West Newbury, Massachusetts. And there is Super Cena. Is WWE and it's a SummerSlam. So uh, I'm curious. Do they always make you play as the character who wins the match? Or do you sometimes have to play as the character who loses the match? Um, so I am curious as to how they handle that, and I guess we'll find out, uh, who they're gonna have me play as, uh, shortly. Yeah, you know Triple H just all like, no, yeah, it's all me. All, tri all for Triple H. 
I must be every champion. Cause I'm I'm the game uh, Triple H. -a. See, I miss when they did they they had that in matches. You know, do the 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 the, the, the boot check and everything else. Like that's not a thing they do that much anymore. Um, and that's like a it's, a it's a very old school thing. They're making sure that you don't have any foreign objects on your person to cheat with. Alright, so who am I playing as? Uh, I am CM Punk. Okay. Defeat John Cena by a pinfall. But we must damage him moderately. Come on, already? With this shit? There we go. Two champions for the price of one. Yeah, wrench that arm and then punch him in the kidney. Screw you, Cena. Screw you, Cena. Like, sometimes it makes it seem like the computer is searching for it, and like that, it was just instant. Like, he instantly knew where the spot was, didn't even search for it, just instantly knew, and that's bullshit. Because I gotta look for it, because I'm a human being and not a sentient AI. Fucking garbage. Fucking garbage. Come on. The hell is... Yeah, reverse it. Now back into the fucking... See, the, the chain wrestling is so terrible. Like, why would you... Why would you do that? Kick it. Really, he dodged that? Really, he dodged that and gave me a terrible looking hip toss? John Cena, you're the worst. I hate you. I hate you so much. Really? The hell, John Cena? What the hell? A terrible looking hip toss. Like, I, I know it's supposed to be accurate because John Cena does a terrible looking hip toss, but... Man. Here we go. Jack his jaw. And then stop on him for a while. There we go. Doing something now. Yes, keep kicking him. I don't I don't even care at this point. Just keep kicking him. Give him a nice suplex. Suplex City, if you will. Yeah. Yes, the John Cena era. So exciting. Really? He couldn't even see that coming and he managed to reverse it. Get out of the way, Triple H. You are going to be collateral damage here in a second. Seriously. Let us drop the elbow. The very sloppy Macho Man elbow. What a maneuver. Uh, let's continue to d damage him moderately. Go to sleep. Now, the suicide dive, I'm not entirely sure how to do. Uh, I think you gotta have a guy up on the ropes and then have a finisher, or a special or something. Oh god. Nope. Getting out of here. Goodbye. Fuck your comeback. I ain't, I ain't dealing with that shit. Fuck you. Super Cena, let that shit run out. Let that shit run out. I am more than happy to be a heel in this scenario, because fuck you video game. The, the, the long and the short of it. I'm hitting L1 now. Oh god. <laughs> so I'm, I'm hitting L He's not getting back in the ring, which is funny. Stop talking about Bret Hart. Yes, King is total chaos. I agree. We're still trying to damage Cena moderately here. Let's see if we can or not. If by the ref you mean Triple H, then yes. And snap suplex there. How are you not damaged moderately yet? You're like in the red. Nope. Nope. 
Nope. Nope. None of that works for me. Damn it, John Cena and your bright white sneakers. And your can-do attitude, and your hustle, and your loyalty, and your respect. Go fuck yourself. Oh, god damn it. Yes, totally electrifying. Really? I'm gonna try to win this thing if I can't, if I can manage to do it. Now see, the suicide guy, supposedly you gotta have a guy like on the ropes, like laying on the ropes. And I don't know how to do that, uh, effectively. Go figure. Slapped you in the face. Now pick him up. I don't want to. No, I, I want to get him on the rope, which is. There we go. All right. This should be the suicide dive. Classified as an oh my god moment. I'm trying to do this all this shit properly. Do it right. Uh, but the game controls occasionally make it difficult, so. Uh, bear with me a bit here. That's my suicide dive. Oh my god moment. Starting the count to ten. He's gonna stop counting. No, get back in the ring. There must be a winner. So, I, 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 is this going to put a hit on my on my health here, or what? Uh, like, I'm, I'm, I'm... Oh, great. Cena has, like, a finisher there. That's not good for me at all. To be, yeah, just, 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 just pin him here. It's fine. He totally won't kick out because he's John Cena. Say what? Yep. He's still lying there. Just do it again. Nope. Alright. Kick him. Hit him with a thing. Do a move to him. I don't know. Something. Give him... Give him something to get me more of my health so I can give him a... a go to sleep and then uh, end up getting pedigree by, by, by Triple H if memory serves me correctly is the, the 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 end of that encounter crap crap on a crap cracker this is not right up there with Hulk Hogan versus Andre the Giant that that match is remembered far too fondly for what it actually was um and obviously if you're talking about WrestleMania three matches you're gonna talk uh Steamboat Savage because that was you know the match the spectacle was... Oh, screw you, John Cena! Too fast. The spectacle was... Hogan Andre, but... I don't think so. I hit... I'm not good about hitting that thing for the comeback. It's not... No! I hit reversal! There we go. I was gonna say, I hit reversal there. Alright, John Cena. It is time to go to sleep. Center of the ring. Hard camera. Do not rope break me, I swear. What? I'm not gonna have an I'm not gonna have enough stamina for this. Let's do it again. That wasn't what I wanted to do. Oh, well yeah, sure. No, it's by a pinfall. Damn it. By a pinfall, which is that's not gonna work. Damn it. Watch it. 
The fact that you have to build, I mean, obviously it, it's building faster than, 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 than it would normally, um, but the fact that you have to build back up to that is uh, insane to me. Crazy. It's crazy to me. I'm pretty sure I reversed that, but, you know, whatever. As long as I'm not gonna get fucking... As long as I'm not gonna get my, my attitude ad adjusted here, I, I feel okay about it. Let's do a suplex. Let's, uh... Regain some stamina here. Let's hope Cena stays down. He probably won't, but let's, let's, let's fucking hope he will. Give him another Macho Man elbow. And pin her from that. I don't even care. I don't even care. Foot on the rope! You piece of shit! Foot on the rope! You tell him, Cole. Triple H didn't see it. I'm the winner. You can't stop me. Hoorah! He's like, no, my foot was on the rope. Damn it. I'm John Cena. I, 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 I never lose. I'm John Cena. I want to say, is it SummerSlam when he got pedigreed, or is it something else? I can't, I can't remember. Like, I, I, I want to say it was SummerSlam. Because it felt like they were in the ring for too long. And when that happens, when you have a match like that, and, and, and there's a good guy and a bad guy, and they're in the ring for too long... You just get, you know, something's going to happen. Um, and I was like, why isn't Triple H leaving the ring? Uh, I, I can't, I, no. It wasn't SummerSlam. I Maybe mean, it was the next one after that. But, oh right, this is the this is the Kevin Nash shit. Right, this is the Kevin Nash shit. Okay. It's Big Daddy Cool Diesel who got the text message. Or somebody sent the text message. OMG. Kevin Nash thought he was dead, lol. Wait, what, ha what happened? But, you sent me a text. And you got in there, and you, you know, gave him a powerbomb. Because, and and then you couldn't pass your physical to, or some bullshit like that. And here's here's Del Rio doing, doing his cash-in nonsense. This whole thing was fucking stupid. It was real fucking stupid. Am I actually playing now? Player one is now Del Rio. How's he still on his feet? Just roll him up. Yeah. Yep. He's going for the pin. This could be it. What? Oh, What's my signature? I don't even know for Del Rio. Like I obviously his obviously his 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 his, his finisher is the armbar, but I don't know what his signature is. This is really weird. Destiny! Is it the, is it the backstabber, maybe? I don't know. Damn it, CM Punk. Dang it, Bobby. Yep, that did it. What? I don't think so. I mean, obviously, if... I wanted to, you know, toss the match, uh, and let, let what really should have happened happen, uh, now, because she goes into the, end of the, end of the, I, I, that's not, that's not, that's not, that's not, that's not how we won, which is fucking bullshit. God damn. Like, why wouldn't you just have me do, like, a move to him? Or whatever, uh, and then win that way. But instead, it's got to be this whole elongated thing. When CM Punk is clearly uh, has been through a hell of a night, and clearly should be losing at this point. But hey, it's a video game, so uh, can't say too much about it, other than the fact that hey, we should be fucking playing it and be glad it's you know gameplay and not cutscenes, so I'll give it that much. Let's do some of this. Make him weaker. We can't tap him out because reasons. Because reasons. 
and he's gonna start reversing shit because the computer does that. No matter how much the game should just be like, it should adjust itself to be on easy for this shit. So I can just completely dominate. Um, come on, punk, get up. Destiny was not a very good game. What are you? No, no. Tilt the world backbreaker. No. I do not think so. Reverse that, Del Rio. Do your damn job. Now, can I pick him up and do a signature from behind? Nope. I cannot. I can do this and get a rope break. That's really funny. That's not how it happened, but it just said beat him by pinfall, so I beat him by pinfall, and I am now your new WWE Champion. Now, my understanding, if I recall correctly, was that they gave Del Rio the belt because they were about to do a tour of Mexico, uh, so it was very much a political reason, other than, you know, actually a storyline reason. It was, hey, we're going to do this, this Latin America tour, so we should probably give him the belt, you know, because he, he'd be like, you know, their homegrown champion, but... Uh, in terms of who was hot at that point, CM Punk, certainly. Del Rio, no. Uh, di did not deserve to be in that position at that point in his career. Just, no. Not in the least, but that is what it is. Uh, now I got a video package here. And uh, they're going to recap everything that, that, that just happened. Because, you know, we didn't already see it. I'm going to sneeze here. <coughs> Excuse me. Mm. Not not trying to sneeze on camera. Uh, but that is what it is. Here comes uh, Kevin Nash with his very disturbing mustache, which is like down here on his lip. It's just gross. It's like, what happened all up here by your nose? Where's the rest of your mustache? Um, there, he, he did that move. And then he pinned him, and that was it. Like, didn't have to do all the shit I just had to do, which is, uh, really funny. And here we get more voiceovers that, you know... Looking at two out of these three guys who aren't in the company anymore, which is funny. Um, and then the COO wants a new number one contender, blah blah blah. I want to know how, how... I don't know. I don't know. But I'm sure, guess what, I'm going to have to play that main event of, of CM Punk versus John Cena again. Because this is, you know, Punk is a hobo. Get it right, he's a fry cook. At Waffle House, I believe, was, was the insult used there. Uh, so here we are. I'm going to obviously skip these intros and then hit pause and then end the video is the plan. Um... Because that is how it will go into tomorrow's episode of this Let's Play of 2K Showcase for the PS4 in 2K15. So, uh, quit match. Yes. And then we'll see. That should be the first three events of that one done. Yeah, we did the first three events, so now we're on uh, a shot of the title. Is it steak? Uh, and then that, that'll be tomorrow. So, uh, join me, won't you? Until next time, uh, as always, I'm your host, Saxlug. And uh, this has been my Let's Play of the 2K Showcase mode on 2K15 on PS4. And I'll see you next time right here on the channel. And I'm out.